bigger than my face. <laughs> oh, that's The video is about to get good. Staycation day two. Tequilas, you got eggs with ham in it, and then some, I'm not exactly sure what this is, it's broccoli, cauliflower, it's like some kind of beef. A little, a little different for breakfast, but it's good. Here we go. Pancakes, chili peelers, eggs, beans, the good stuff. And we're gonna stick our feet in the pool, not in the pool, we're gonna stick our feet in the hot tub first thing in the morning. So I know we have a few new viewers and subscribers lately and our favorite part of YouTube and creating these videos is interacting with you guys. So we highly encourage you to comment below if you're new here or if you just never commented before on our videos. Comment below, let us know where you're from, let us know if you've been to PV before, where your favorite restaurants are, or where your favorite, uh, favorite place to vacation is, or how you found our videos. Just comment below, say hi, tell us your name. Maybe tell us your actual name, that way it's not like Freaky Mama 75. <laughs> now we're gonna walk, it's about just under a mile to where we're going to lunch. So we're, what's the name of it? Mr. Cream. Mr. Cream what? Pancakes, pancakes and waffles. We're going to Mr. Cream Pancakes and Waffles. About a mile walk away, so it's ranked super highly in TripAdvisor, so we'll let you guys know how it is. shopping center. It's over here by the marina. There's Starbucks, it's Bar Light, it's all sorts of stuff. So it's kind of hard to get to if you're over in El Centro though. But we'll see if it's worth it. It's busy. Found it. Found it. Alright this is where we're at. Mr. Cream Pancakes and Waffles. First impressions? First impressions are the marina area is really nice. No, yeah, we've never been over here. All right, Hill, what did you get? Oh my goodness. I don't know, but it has strawberries and Nutella and bananas. I got bacon, eggs, and one with almonds, whipped cream, bananas, and chocolate. Good. I would recommend getting one with whipped cream on it. Mm -hmm. The whipped Greg's, cream is. Super the whipped cream, good. it looks normal, but it's really good. You're slowing down, Hill? I think I can do it. You're so close. Mine is gone, by the way. <laughs> Uh, the waffle was really good. The whipped cream was really, really good. And mine was covered with lots of really good fruit. And I guess this. Um, however, I gotta give I gotta give the torch to Freddy's. I think Freddy's in El Centro has um, a better waffle batter. Yeah. It's only uh, my opinion. Mr. Cream has a really cool view. I really like yeah. this area. We've never been anywhere over here, so yeah. this is pretty cool. It's different. I gotta give it to you, Freddy. <laughs> on Facebook different people have said they live in this area and I was thinking when the world is there but there's actually a lot of restaurants that's maybe 
50 or more just in the little area we were with some really good views. It was a pretty cool area. I can definitely see the appeal to be in that area. I think we would probably get bored because we don't have a boat and we don't golf. But there's lots of places to eat and we uh, obviously like to do that. So. <sighs> Victor's something. It looks like it has good Mexican food. It's ranked pretty highly in PV. Uh, so we really like the Marina Vallarta area that we went to earlier today. So it inspired us to check out some more since we're not over this way. So might as well, right? Yeah, and uh, I just want some good Mexican food and a good margarita. So we'll catch up with you guys from there. First impressions. Like bringing the shots of tequila. Let's go. No. What'd you get? Huge. <laughs> Huge. Chili, uh, Chili relleno. Chili relleno. And beans, rice, and guac. I got the fish and chips. So all my food is the same color. Plus the watermelon. So I got fried fish. Someone's eating all my french fries. And some more buttered bread. Good thing we did burpees. Alright, well they brought us free tequila shots and now free Kahlua and Bailey's. What is this? They brought it. Yeah. It's so pretty. It's bigger than my face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's This video is about to get good. Alright, well right after they brought the mango I don't margarita, know what's happening. they brought two more shots. I had the other two. So if I start scoring my words, that's why. <laughs> Here's mine. Go ahead. How is it? I think we might be taking the cab home. <laughs> no, it's doubtful. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> That was what, number five? <laughs> that was the fourth shot I've taken, plus the other drink, and then this one has three shots he said in it. It's about to get good. <laughs> Don't zoom in, please. expensive side if you're coming from El Centro but if you're coming from you know maybe another port city like Seattle or Boston or New York I don't know it's probably it's still way cheaper than anywhere in the States before coming here I would have never suggested anybody come here but I think now I mean if you're over in this way I think it's definitely definitely worth checking out plenty of restaurants uh, plenty of places to get a drink plenty of air-conditioned places if wow. I went to PV for the first time I would spend minimal time over in Marina Verde it seems somewhat Americanized in that, um, I don't know a good way to say it, it just seems very American. It seems a little bit like uptown Dallas, which, not a bad thing, but if you're coming from the States, it's probably not exactly what you're searching for. However, if you've been in PV for a while, or if you've been visiting here for 20 years and never been over that way, definitely check it out. It's very cool, lots of bars, lots of restaurants to get uh, drinks at. What's the name? Victor's gives you free shots. So I mean, that's that's a reason to go over there. The marina itself, it's pretty cool to walk around and look at people's boats and feel crappy about yourself that you don't own something <laughs> amazing. Yeah. But we're all about have less. That's why we don't have a yacht. So, of course we can afford one. You know, that's just not really our thing. <laughs> so, uh, very cool area. I would spend maybe a day over there. We'll probably go back with some friends um, just because they like to drink. <laughs> they get free shots over there. So with that said, if you're new here, comment below, let us know where you're from, subscribe to this channel, make sure you click the bell, that way you get notified every time we get a new video. Hope I'm not messing this up too much because I've had a few shots. 
And if you are not new here, thanks for making this long to the video once again. Please share this with your friends. That way we can keep making friends.